So it's law firms like the Tidrick Law Firm that are screwing things up for gig workers, right? They are settling for peanuts, for hundreds of dollars. And I'm going to back this up with an email from another attorney. I'm not going to mention his name, but this comes from a reliable source, right? If you look at their reviews, this is atrocious, folks. 3.4 stars, the Tidrick Law Firm. This asshole here calls up drivers and says, listen, accept a few hundred dollars. By doing that, he is lowering the bar. If you can get out, try and break your alliance with the Tidrick Law Firm. If you're thinking of joining from them, run as far as you can from them. Spit on these cheap hoes, on these cheap prostitutes selling us out, right? Unacceptable. Now, the, the lawyer here says, we are seeking reasonable value for our clients' cases. Reasonable value is full value minus an amount that factors in the risks of litigation and the client's need for money. All indications are that we are going to have to go all the way through trial, arbitration hearing to get Uber and Lyft to pay fair settlements. These are fist fights all the way. They are fighting every step of the process. You got to go in there as a law firm and go all 15 rounds, jabs, uppercuts, hooks. You got to tire these MFs out, right? You can't be like the Tedrick law firm that's, hey, you take a few hundred bucks and let's run. That's, that's a sign of a desperate, desperate law firm. No wonder they have 3.4 stars. Ladies and gentlemen, you didn't do your, your, your homework on this company, right? Do not join the Tedrick law firm. Or call them up and say, listen, I am not settling for peanuts. So this attorney writes, Lyft and Uber are picking um, off a lot of claimants with ridiculously low settlements. There's an attorney, Tidrick, there he is, this fucking asshole, who is settling claims for peanuts. He's calling and emailing claimants, offering them hundreds of dollars to wrap up their claims. Who knows? Maybe this Tidrick prick is working with Dara. Hey, Dara. I can get these guys to settle on 100 bucks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do that, do that, do that, do that. Who knows what this asshole is up to? There are many drivers who, for one reason or another, are accepting these deals. Do not accept these deals, guys. You're in there for the long haul. You're in there for the big do dollars. Don't be a desperate, desperate individual who succumbs to the pressure of these idiots, right? So... As long as Uber and Lyft are able to whittle away on the outstanding claims, they have a dis disincentive to pay fair settlements to anyone. I don't expect any fair offers from Uber or Lyft for at least six months and more than a year. It is bullshit that they can get away with delaying payment of wages that were due, but they can. Perhaps after we win a few cases, the dam will break and they will settle the other cases, but we can't count on this. We have to plan on going to trial on all of them or they will not pay fair value. That's from the attorney directly to me, exposing this cheap hoe here, this cheap prostitute, the Tidrick, right? Guys, call these guys up and say, listen, I want out. Or if they call you up, if this Mr. Desperado calls you up and says, hey, take a few hundred, on, a few hundred dollars, just accept whatever you can. Your answer should be in Russian, Niet, in German, nichts, nada, nothing. Nichts, nix. You will not have any part of signing off on a few hundred dollars. You know why? Because you ruin it for the rest of the drivers, for the rest of the gig workers. Just like gig workers work together, class action lawyers have to go out there and also band together and be prepared to fight all 15 rounds. This guy is buckling and caving in the first round. He's already on his knees. I'll, I'll take whatever I can. Uh, 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 spare me don't knock me out you got to go in there for the knockout right this is how you deal with these big companies believe me i've taken mcdonald's to court i won i took time warner to court i won i got big settlements because i'm not going to play their little phony game you got to go in there and brawl to the very very bitter end folks that's just the way it is huge shout out to my sponsor display ride go check them out a ride share monitoring platform, non-stop footage uploaded in the cloud. So, you know, massive deterrent. Or go and get yourself a dash cam, one of the two. And then, folks, do consider Curiel. Go download um, the app, please. 
sorry, I'm just adjusting the screen here a little bit. And um, it's absolutely anything delivered. I have the links below. Also, Kova, uh, Gig Protection Plan. Check them out below. And if you have any questions or if, if you're part of this Tidrick Law Firm, come forward, speak out, right? But if they're calling you and trying to have you settle for peanuts, please, folks, don't do it. Do not do it. Have a great day. Like and subscribe. I'm always here for you fighting the fight for drivers. Have a great day.